raw foods <laughs> raw foods can be when you eat raw foods you free up a lot of energy so if you want to do a cleanse depending on how serious your problem is or how much more energy you want how much detoxification you, can, you want to do you could do raw foods for half a day for a morning for a full day for a week or a month or even depending on how long you can do forever um, you'll definitely get up a lot of mucus and it'll help clean and drain your lymphatic system as long as your kidneys are actually exiting the, the, the waste that the lymphatic system collects which is the lymphatic system collects the waste metabolic waste from your cells so these cells emit naturally a waste and then that goes in to your lymphatic system and hopefully that should exit through your kidneys so I know I know loads of people who have gotten well from countless diseases and illnesses and issues from doing taking herbs for and doing a raw food diet or especially high in fruits some people just do only fruits which is like the highest way of cleansing um, and having a lot of energy often but if you're detoxing hard you'll have less energy but if you're not detoxing hard and you're eating fruits you'll have like abundant energy I know a guy who does ultra marathons like two three marathons in a row four marathons all in a row in one race like 100 miles or more <laughs> just he only eats fruits and he's only been eating fruits for like seven years <laughs> no nuts no seeds nothing no green leaves and it's not something that i'd necessarily recommend and it's not something i'd rec i'd actually say not to do it it depends on the person but he used to get injuries when he was just eating a cooked vegan diet and now when he switched to raw ve um, raw vegan like fruitarianism he just didn't get injured anymore because the fruits strengthened his, his body so much and such a fast recovery. He never got any like shin splints or ankle or knee or leg injuries anymore and he was doing like epic amounts of running. <laughs> Generally speaking, a lot of these people who switch to veganism end up beating their records and especially the people who switch to raw foodism, they definitely beat their records. And I know this from my own personal experience just for your own information like the power of raw foods is incredible I don't know if you've ever thought about this but humans seem to think we're special because we're the only species out of trillions on the planet that don't that that, that don't eat a raw food diet <laughs> some people are fanatical about raw foods I am not but I'm just telling you the way it is like all other animals except for displaced animals that humans displace that go lose their habitat and go rumbling in our bins like the bears croaking in your kitchen <laughs> all animals eat usually fresh right in the spot generally just wild <laughs> and it's not cooked it's fresh it's raw it's simple it's really natural like that so when we start eating a bit more like that we ain't gonna be eating like from, from the ground like totally fresh and it's not gonna be wild but when we start going that direction with just simple raw foods or even just like a fruit based diet because we are frugivores anatomically i believe strongly man i'm telling you you just feel so good like mentally emotionally spiritually in your mood will rocket generally go go very much higher and you just feel more inspired and more less less negative in your mind and your emotions but yeah your physical performance and your athleticism and your physical ability and your recovery and will all improve whilst your sleep needing you need less sleep because you don't need to recover from the food you're eating that's all like kind of like you know billion ingredients in a meal and uh, <laughs> just a lot of cooked things or heavier things or grains for example so it's just easier to pr process so these are some of the tools that I know regarding healing from stuff like you know just countless countless people healing diabetes in like 30 days easily type 2 diabetes even type 1 massive improvement and I'm sure there's been stories of type 1 literally being no longer being in in, in the case anymore in your body so acne, losing your hair, uh, depression, anxiety, um, liver complaints, gallstones, um, eyesight improved, out of your wheelchair. I've read like so many different testimonials about things with raw foods and green smoothies and green juices and herbs. Even myself, like I've said in other videos, I used to be 
I used to be like the fittest guy around, you know, almost. I used to have endless energy. I used to always run up and down my stairs. I had too much energy. I couldn't walk. <laughs> I'd run. And then I ended up like totally and utterly wiping myself out, you know, it's crazy. And then I was like a zombie for years, you know, wrecked adrenals. And then the herbs got me back on track and the raw foods and what I'm saying. And yeah, it's an interesting topic. So I'll leave you at that anyway. That's a long enough video for now. Beautiful tree, beautiful nature, beautiful air, out here underneath the sky, above the ground, appreciating the land, sniffing the oxygen, the good old gas all around us, talking to my friends on YouTube, so I hope you enjoyed this video. So, uh, thumbs up, let us know if you liked it, and I hope it proved helpful to you, and I hope you get healthy, fit, strong, uh, more wise, empowered, free, lighter, and healthier, and happier. I know you're on the right track. If you're still here, you're totally, totally with it. And I'll see you again in another video. Until then, take care. Lots of love.